What's this? Whoa. Whoa. Hey guys, thanks for stopping in. And in this video, we are going through the 10 by 10 unit that we picked up and we actually rented. Now, very exciting news. I sold a bunch of items last night on whatnot, made $343. And if you pair that with the $434 we made a couple days ago, we are well into the profit already, even though we had to rent this for a month and it was $205 to rent, which is way more than I thought it was gonna be. But uh, we did what we had to do, and guess what? We still have a lot of stuff to go through. So we're gonna go through a couple things. We gotta put a couple boxes together for our whatnot auctions and see if we can un uncover any really cool and special uh, uh, finds, but let's switch over to the GoPro and get right into it. All right, guys, welcome back. If you have not seen the other videos on this unit, definitely go check them out because we got a lot of cool stuff in here and uh, we're going to go through a few items and see what we can find uh this isn't going to be a too deep of a dive because i have limited space i don't have my truck tonight i have my car so i can't take a bunch of stuff home with me um, so i have to be a little bit more selective and make a game plan um, but i got my table here i got my boxes and oh what's this just a little box i was like wow Maybe I found some jewelry. But if you guys didn't know, this is the continuation of the Dollar to Dotson Challenge. My decals are all falling off there. But all of the profits we're making came from a single dollar and we've been flipping to get to our goal, which is a Dotson 240Z. And this is where we're at for our budget. Now, this is personal stuff. So we're leaving this here and we can add to that as we go along. But this is all new stuff, so. And it looks like kitchen stuff. So let's pick it up and go through it. See if there's anything good in here or if there's just stuff we're gonna donate. With storage units, you gotta look everywhere because you can find some cool stuff. This isn't anything, but the box itself is cool. We're gonna keep that. You know, butt pan, little metal basket. It's kind of cool. Cake trays. I don't think these are worth anything. They're a little bit bulky to be sending out, so. I think this is just gonna end up being scrap metal. We have some other scrap that we can add to this. So we'll put this over here. You can see there was some other big pots and pans over there. Maybe somebody local would like them, but I don't know. We'll we'll see what we're gonna try and do with that. All right, there's a big box. And there's a nice futon as well. My goodness. I don't know what's in here, but it seems like something heavy. Some, okay, let's see. Wow. Let's see here. So we have a clipboard. Julie Old Crow Tutorials. Picture World Finds. Okay, interesting. This is interesting. Look at this. Dirty box. But look at all the buttons. Wow, that is cool. All sorts of different buttons. Even metal buttons. Look at these. These are cool. These look like uh, family crests or something. So definitely going to keep these pretty interesting. Uh, somebody will buy all these buttons. I'll put these up as a lot. Maybe get a couple dollars for them on whatnot. And this should be pretty relatively easy to ship because it's small enough to fit in to a priority shipping box. So that's a winner. We'll keep that. We'll bring that home. All right, here's some more. We could run a second a second one. We got some beads in here, including some like teddy bears and stuff. Those are buttons. These buttons, people, people like buttons. So I don't know what it is. They're kind of interesting. Their designs are pretty cool. So this is a winner. We will definitely be able to sell this. So again, pretty easy shipping as well. If you sell both of those to the same person or even multiple people, doesn't matter. Um, they'll scoop those up and uh, be useful to them as well. So if you guys are interested in anything, go check out Whatnot. What's this? Look at that. Little watch. Oh, I've seen these straps. These straps are magnetic. So look at that. I don't know what kind of watch this is, but I could probably clean it up a little bit. It's got like a little bit of a diamond dial or a dazzle dial with it's got like a stardust or whatever um, but it's probably not anything uh, expensive but everybody likes to, a good watch so we'll definitely keep that and then what's this any markings on here i'm waiting to find some gold and silver because i i'm telling you there's so much crafting stuff in this uh unit there's got to be something in here all right i don't know what that is that could be nothing the color's a little weird little calculator people like the little calculators ah, that's cool what is that Oh, look at that. Isn't that cool? Keeping that for my wife. 
She loves stuff like that. Anything dainty and cool, I guess I'll put in the uh, in the box. So we'll put like the watch, the jewelry, even like the card. We'll put the card in there. What else we got? Mickey and Minnie. These look like stamps, I think. Oh, these are stamps too. These are like actual stamps. So, all right, we'll keep these. These are like old stamps and usable stamps. We'll see if anybody wants those. If we can try and put them together, we'll do that. Ooh, dots, okay. I could use that for the whatnot shows. Pre-number them and then just stick the dots on there. Or are these the reusable ones? Darn, they're not reusable, but that's all right. I could use those. What are these? These are like some stickers, some Hello Kitty stickers. Keep those. These are all like little Twinkie Winky. Oh, no way, look at this. Is this a Nantucket basket? C and C, is there something in here? There's like a little penny in here. P I P A I. I know that if this is a if this is a Nantucket basket, these pendants can go for a lot of money. So that's pretty cool. We'll put that in the uh, the tin. All right, we got like a little rosary thing. Not sure what that is. Oh, bracelet. Look at this. Has stones in it. Here's the clasp. Oh, it's Avon. Okay, so they're probably not real stones, I'm guessing, but it is Avon, so that will definitely sell. We'll get a little bit of money out of this, too. Aw, oh, a little frog. Looks like a clay frog or something. All right, snowflakes. Kind of cool. Some clips. Another bracelet. Keep that. Got some money here. We got a little penny. And a created by. A little pin here. Some earring. SD card. Sand disc and a Visa gift card. That might be, eh, maybe there's something on there. I don't know. All right, I think that's all that's useful in here. Except for this little angel, clay angel. I like it. Got a couple more stamps too. So we'll put the stamps over here. The new beadwork, kind of a cool book. Keep that. All right, I got some rubber bands here and a hole cutter, hole punch, a little basket. What else we got here? These boxes are so dirty, but okay, here we go. Got a bunch of little bead cases. We could sell these uh, individually, so that's pretty nice. So we'll take these. This one's open. Looks like some fell out, but these are a lot of these little beads. So maybe I can kind of clean these up, but we're gonna take the whole thing. So, and then look at this. We got one of those fans, one of those Asian fans, I think. Look at that. That's nice. It's actually in really good shape. So I think that'll sell as well. So what I like to do guys is we do uh, $1 auctions on my whatnot. And basically, you know, I'll, I'll put this out there. I'll kind of fan it out, tell them what it is. Tell them, you know, we're starting it at a dollar, see what happens and uh, press go in 20 seconds, people start bidding. And uh, if they win, they're usually pretty stoked about it because I start things so cheap, people pay really whatever they want to pay. It's almost like an online tag sale. So I then work really hard to get the orders shipped out very fast. Look at that bir birthday cake, brand new and it smells amazing. Just a little dusty. There we go. Maybe I'll sell some candles. I have a bunch of candles, so maybe we'll give candles a try. Any others? This one's kind of shot. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's an Elgin. Hey, that's a nice ladies watch. Look at that, guys. It's a quartz, but this is a this is a nice watch. Get a couple of dollars for that. Wow, and I like the bracelet too. So yeah, this is not like a, you know, this is not like a million dollar watch for sure. But you know, maybe get 10, 15 bucks for it at auction. I mean, if I'd put it on eBay, I might get 30 to 50. But yeah, hey, that's a good find. That is a really good find. Wow. All right, we're gonna look into that too. Wow, hey, we're 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 killing it. We're crushing it right now. Crushing it. Oh, we got Minnie Mouse. We'll keep Minnie because Minnie is awesome. They smell pretty good, but I don't know what they are. They almost look like urinal cakes. I don't have my gloves with me today, but so you can roast me in the comments. That's fine. All right, we got another calculator. Hey, and it works. Sweet. Couple of calculators. Snow. We don't need the snow. A little bear. It's like a squishy bear, but. Look at that, we got Mickey. So we got Mickey and Minnie. I think we had Minnie over here. Yeah, so we have both of them. So those will sell because they're Mickey and Minnie and they usually always sell. Got Santa here. Santa, I know him. Any elf fans? Drop it in the comments, any elf fans. Okay, I think we're gonna start a new trash because we have one trash 
And this one actually is probably gonna be donate. It's just gonna be like household stuff. Like all this stuff is kind of household stuff. It's not really junk. There's value in here for other people, just not for me. All right, some stickers. If it was a bigger bundle of stickers, I'd keep it, but kind of a small bundle. So we will go ahead and donate it. Now, what are these? Let's move this down here for now. What's this? Whoa. Whoa, what are these? Are these all just like, look at the fish. Fancy lady, what the heck did I just open up? What are these things? These are like, look at the fish. I'm a big fish guy. But what are these? Are these like, they're just like uh, pressed metal into shapes and designs. What are they? Are they, I mean, look, this says five bucks on it. This is a pendant. What are these? These are pins. Whoa, you guys, this is all like, Pendants and jewelry, $6 large, $5 medium. I wonder if this person was like selling at flea markets or something. Holy cow, look at all there. This is a lot of value here. These are buttons, these are crosses, but I don't know if these are pendants or not. These are Amy Riley Dottie. Well, you don't need to hear that. Look at that, some skulls. I don't even know what these are. They're just skulls. Maybe they're to make into pendant. This feels heavy. These are like beads and charms. And this is a, uh, wow. Man, I just want to see if any of these are marked gold and silver. I'm going to have to check into these. No way I can look at all of them now, but let's keep looking through this. So we got these uh, like porcelain heads or something. Maybe they're to make buttons. Maybe these are all button making things. Not all of them. Some of them are definitely pendants. Like that's a pendant. These are pendants. Like that's a frog pendant. Wow. Look at this key. That's awesome. It's like a skeleton key. That's so cool. Holy cow, guys. This is insane. Wow, we're gonna make some money. Look at that beautiful rose. That is cool. And look, this whole thing, this is like pounds and pounds of this. Little skull. Everything's marked for like six bucks, five bucks. Wow, oh my gosh, this is cool. You know what? I could probably sit down for uh, for a portion of this. Look at all of these. Uh, hey, and what I'm talking about is the whatnot show. A lot of times I'm standing for like four or five hours and my back starts to hurt. Um, but this stuff I can kind of sit down, do one bag at a time and just run through it. Oh, nativity. That's cool. These pendants are cool. These are red skull. I think they're beads. Yeah, I think they're beads. These look like they're to be made into like hoop necklaces. Look at all of this. This is like a, a random bag of stuff. I need to go through this to see if there's any silver in here because all it takes is one bag to be filled with silver and it could be a good bit of money just sitting there in precious metals. Now, do I assume that there is? No, but oh, that's got a good color to it though. See that? It's like a really rich color. I'm gonna look at that really quick. Probably not, because they got a sticker on here that says a dollar. But you know what? Weirder things have happened. Weirder things have happened. Let's see if there's any marking. I don't see a marking on it, but interesting. All right, let's keep looking here. We got some masks. Small, medium, large. $4, $3, $2. So yeah, if I run the whole thing for a buck, I should get a couple dollars. So let's just say conservatively, I get $2 for each bag. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. I mean, there's probably a couple hundred bucks in here. Look at that. And this is something I could run separately. And like, that's, that's a really cool piece. That's a cool pendant. That is so rad. I can't believe it. I was hoping I'd find something like this. I mean, I was hoping it would be pure gold and silver, but I mean, I'll take this. Gold and silver is cool, but stuff that moves is even cooler to me. I mean, look at this. Ha, 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 ha. This is unbelievable. Storage units, baby, storage units. Buttons and pendants. Look at the cat. Look at the cat, that is so funny. We got these seahorses. These look like they should be buttons, but I just don't know what they are. This is so unbelievably crazy here's another pendant bunch of pendants here look at the skull look at that it's got a design on the skull you guys can see that let's see we got more here i love you this is wow i did not expect this stone stone beads i know somebody who wants these there's a guy um tasco i don't know if you're you're in here um checking out the videos but if you are shout out to tasco he buys a lot of my stonework and uh 
I was able to move a bunch of stuff because of him, so I appreciate that. Look at that, the Halloween stuff. We've got a jack-o'-lantern, a witch's hat, a witch riding a broom, carved pumpkin. I mean, this is just really cool. This is just really, really cool. We got these heads, these porcelain heads. I don't know anything about the porcelain heads. They're cool. I just don't know anything about them. Wow, you guys, this is really, this is really something. I love the fish. The fish is my favorite, but I don't know what it's supposed to be. Anything else cool in here? I mean, lots of cool stuff. I mean, look at that hardware. That is cool. I what if we get some more of that? That'd be a cool drawer. Bunch of crosses in here, cross pendants. Wow. Okay, very cool. That is unbelievable. That That's unbelievable. Not only is this good stuff, and even if it's not gold and silver, this will all sell. This will all sell. And a couple hours, I'll have a few hundred bucks. Unbelievable. Wow, okay, I'm pretty excited about that. So let's uh, let's press on, and uh, this could be some of the best stuff that we find in the unit so far, but you know, we have a lot of unit to go. There's a lot left to go. So we got the dirty box, we got this box, we got this jewelry, that jewelry, should make for a good show. This is just cleaning supplies. So let's uh, see what's in this basket here. It looks like there's a lot of clothes here clothes do pretty well for me i don't sell them for top dollar again start them at a buck and you just go from there all right so what's the first thing we got here oh champion nice champion size medium uh, athletic wear pants these look good we'll put these in the keeps we have a we have a little robe action here i can't tell if this is dirty or clean i think it's clean it's got like some dirt on it might need a wash. I'm gonna donate this one. I just don't want it hanging around. Donate, donate. I'm looking to, I'm looking to get some interesting pieces. White stag. I did sell a couple of sweaters. This one looks like it's missing a few buttons. Man, with all the buttons we found in this unit, you think they would have, I think they would have fixed their own, you know? All right, we got a little Yukon piece. Yukon Law, it's pretty cool. Full zip, Yukon Law. It does have a hole in it, but you know, for a buck, I think somebody will pick it up. So we'll keep the Yukon. What's this one? This is an interesting piece, but it's pretty dirty. It's kind of thrashed on the side there. Hard to see it on the camera, I bet. But it's a little, look at this, a little sundress. Is this what that is? Is this a little sundress? We'll keep that. We got a couple ladies that buy clothes on the, on the, uh, on the shows. So, you know, some of these lighter dresses, I don't mind. Madonna Rico, New York, size eight. Kind of cute. We'll keep them. Ooh, whoa. Won't keep that. Thank you. Thank you. Is this a dress? It is a little black dress. Very nice. Got some lace on the top. Kind of swoops over. Got some dresses. We'll run some dresses. Why not? What the heck? We'll run them. All right. That'll do it for this one here. Hey, we'll put the uh, the donatable clothes here in the bin. Man, there's just so much stuff in here. I'm looking around, getting a little overwhelmed, but it's all right. That's why we rented this for a month, so we have some time. Cami, nah. It's like Cameo, except for Cami, no. <laughs> Tech gear, long underwear, thermals. I'm gonna go ahead and say no thank you for now. Old Navy, pink, pink dress. Extra, extra large. I don't know why I'm saving these, but I'm saving them. Sun tees, extra large. No, the heck, no thanks. Nah, some pants. What do we got here? There's a lot of hair on that. I know, I know, it can be clean and stuff, but I won't be doing it. Being a little picky at this point. I don't know why I'm being picky. I don't know if it's just like fatigue. Sometimes it's like that, like you get fatigued on stuff. Ooh, Dickies with the pocket, love that gonna keep the dickies with the pocket but yeah guys it's i found that it's it is important to take your time because you get fatigued going through these units and you find some great stuff look at this shirt someone's gotta like that bobby brooks christmas shirt love that little wrinkled crinkled but we like it. i love this old navy lots of color i don't know why i like so much color i just do we got skulls on the pants skulls on the pants Cocoa, um, sure, it will sell some cocoa, why not? Faux show, cocoa faux show. All right, HS, something sold, little blouse action, lightweight, and interest, just interesting enough for me to salvage, so. Now, I say salvage, 
These are all gonna be donated, of course, so. What's this? These pants? Oh boy, Bobby Brooks. All right, Bobby Brooks. It's interesting, so we'll run it. All right, we'll take the donation clothes, we'll put the donation clothes here and here, and we'll take the donation clothes with us today. If we can fit them in the car, maybe that's what we'll do. Let's, uh, let's address the elephant in the room here, which I haven't addressed at all, but I have seen it multiple times. I just forget to keep mentioning it. This is a sewing machine. I don't know if it even has a power cord. I think it goes here, power cord off on. What kind is this? I don't know what kind this is. Oh, a Kenmore, duh, there it is. Let's uh, take a picture of this and see if it's worth anything. Go to Google, Google search, take a picture, and there we go. We're looking at, let's see, eBay. Oh, it's got the handle. That's cool. Visit, this is a vintage series Kenmore model, th one three, no, that's a different model. Do we have a model number somewhere? Kenmore, Kenmore. This thing definitely needs a good wipe down, but I think I saw, do we have a model somewhere? Model, model, model. What is in here? There's gotta be something in here. I don't know what model this is, guys. Oh, oh, wait a minute. What's uh, that? Uh, oh, here we go. Here we go. Right here. Model number 385. And there's a bunch of numbers after that. So let's look that up. Kenmore sewing machine model 385. All right, let's see. All right, there it is. Filter. So there's 117 listed. Show 107. Oh, wait. Whoops. Go down to sold and completed. No exact matches. Let me see. That's not it, is it? Okay. Kenmore model. One two six one two zero nine zero. Let's try that. This is the exact. Ooh, lots of parts. Yeah, I think that's the one. Sold. Boom. Fifty nine ninety nine. Fifty four dollars. Eighty nine dollars. So mine's not in great shape because I don't know if it has the power cord or not. We're definitely gonna have to take a look. That's not it. We're gonna have to take a look for the power cord. Uh, then it'll be complete and we can test it. And if I can do that, that then means I could get more money for it. Um, but I'm gonna say this is worth like maybe 30 bucks. 30 bucks, that's not bad. Nice little sewing machine. We will, uh, I don't know if we're gonna take it today, but we'll we'll grab it. Yeah, we'll take it today, why not? We're just taking it directly, so. See if there's anything in this basket, anything worth anything here. Jewelry making for fun and profit. The Beater's Handbook, making your own jewelry. This person was obsessed with making jewelry, jewelry which is awesome. Connecticut Giving Back, Connecticut The Ultimate Holiday Feast, and medicine. All right, we will go ahead and toss all that nonsense. And I think we'll keep the books for now and see if anybody wants them to go along with our crafting series here. See here, this is all, I think this is sculpting clay. And there's a lot of it here. So I will sell this whole thing. This will go in a flat rate shipping box, a medium one. And this all will sell for a lot. So we got a lot of skull, sculpty, sculptable clay. So we'll get this sold in a hot second tomorrow and hopefully make a good profit, which we should. I mean, that's some really good, that's a lot of, this whole thing is clay, the whole thing. So somebody's gonna get a great deal on here. Look, this one's just $1.25 by itself. I'm gonna do this whole thing for a dollar. That's what I'm doing, guys. If you want in on it, you should have been there already. I've told you a million times. If you're into crafting or if you know anybody into crafting, they need to hop into the show. This is a fancy looking box. Let's take a look. My goodness, that is a cool looking box. Look at that, more beads, guys. Look at the beads, so cool. I sold all the beads and made a good amount of money on beads the other night, so super cool. Wow, okay, this is all beads, all of it. I could sell this whole thing for a dollar. I probably won't, I'll probably split this into lots, um, but unbelievable the amount of beads in here she's even like real rocks and stuff tasco you're gonna love this get your get your wallets ready look at that wow this whole thing is a dream an absolute dream wow 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 this box is really cool itself this is a cool box unbelievable very cool so this is definitely going home with me guys and we are going to be running this at our show tomorrow and this box is just super cool i love it with the handles there is literally like 10 pounds of beads here. And I'm so glad I'm into whatnot now because honestly, 
a week ago, I wouldn't have, uh, or a couple weeks ago, I wouldn't have kept this stuff. I would have tried to donate it. I wouldn't know what to do with it. Look at this. Oh, wow. Look at all the tools. That comes in handy for like watchmaking and stuff, but obviously everything else as well. I don't know what this is. Look at this. We got crimps, pliers. Look at these are like flat pliers. This is all, this is all related to working on, working on jewelry. Look at this thing. I don't know what that is. This is like a gravity. Whoa, spring fed. What the heck? Whoa, that's awesome. These tools, this will go, this will all go for a pretty penny. Look at that. That is a nice hammer. Wow. All right, we might put some items aside and run them separately. But look at the little hammer. Oh my gosh, have you guys ever seen, uh, what is it, Shawshank Redemption? It's like uh, it's like what Andy Dufresne used to, to tunnel out. Only it wasn't a hammer, it was a, a rock. Look at the little anvil. I love that, bead buddy. Oh, that's so cool. That is so cool, guys. Wow, that's awesome. This is awesome. Okay, I eyelet punch set. We'll put that aside. So we'll have a bunch of we'll have a bunch of tools here, but uh, some of this I'm gonna run separately. But temper tools. Wow, this is awesome. Okay, all right. We like this box. We like this box a lot. Oh, this is gonna be so much fun. I was stressing out today because I was running all over the place. I had to pack up some orders, but got everything done. And I was able to make it out here, which is what I was hoping to do. And uh, we're, we're ending up getting some really great stuff. So that is so cool. And what's this stuff, glue? Berry art? I don't know what this stuff is. It like stained the back half of the bottle. Um, lamination glue. It's like glitter glue. Mod Podge. Very cool. We'll keep all that. Why not? This is awesome. Okay. I don't know where to go. I don't know what to do next. Anything in here? Well, a couple things in here. Let's look at this. Nothing in that one. In here? Nope. What are you? You're just a container. But you're a cool container. I like you. Fix bond create. Royal organizer. What's this? Royal. Oh, is this the organizer? Look at that. Royal organizer. And we have the booklet for it. So we're taking that. Personal photos. What's this? Uh, wisdom cards. Oh, the power of chakras. Ah, I see. All right. We got some twine. What is this thing? What are you? What are you? You're an iPod, are you? Rue case? What are you? I want to know what you are. You're a USB-C little piece of tech. I don't know what you are, but we'll keep you. We'll keep you. St. Anthony, pray for us. And we get both of these sold for a buck. Pretty cool, but I don't need it. Donate. Same with this and these. All right. There's just so much stuff. I'm just kind of working right here for now. Well, I want to know what's in this box. Let's work towards that. So we got some scrap here. I don't need to really look at that. I know what it is. Let's see what all is in here. This might be something I take back later, but markers, don't need them. Chalk, don't need it. Some ribbon, maybe. Uh, some paint, it's brand new paint. No, there's a crack in the bottom. You guys probably can't see. Pull this out. Woo, bless me. Thank you for everybody who said it in the comments or in their head. All right, look at this. What's this? Artist kit, okay. Let's see if everything's in here or not. Hey, it looks like everything's in here. Cool. All right, we're keeping that. People like that stuff. All right, keeps file, keeps, keeps, keeps. All right, some extras, an exacto knife. Okay, lots of pens. I found out that pens don't sell. I had a bunch of pens that I tried to sell all at once. Nobody wanted it. So I said, okay, no problem. All right, the rest of this, the rest of that donation. Look at all this ribbon, guys. $1.99 just for that ribbon. All of this ribbon is gonna come in handy. Somebody's gonna want this. Look at the bread ribbon, all this stuff. Look at some beads in here, whatever that is. But look at, they got some Christmas ribbon. I mean, it makes sense. Most of the time you need ribbon is around Christmas. Am I right? So this is good. We'll probably not take this home tonight, but it's good to know where this stuff is so I can get it for my next show. Oh, and look at this, ink pads. I sold so many stamps. Here's all the ink. Unbelievable, okay. And there's a couple of stamps in here as well. Looks like well-used ones. A little watering can, a little watering can action. So, all right, cool, we got some ink, we got some ribbon. 
I like it. I like it. I like it. All right, what's in this one? Look, you can already see it. Look at all the beads and everything in here. Unbelievable. All right, let's look in this one and then we'll go to the next one because I'm excited for the next one. It looks intriguing, but you can't count anything out. You can't count anything out of the Ooh, Good thing I caught that with my foot. Did you see it? Whoa. Okay. Okay. This, uh, this is insane. Absolutely bananas. Wow. Okay, let's get this back up here. Wow. Okay. This is unbelievable. I don't know what these are for. Some glass pieces, beads, some blocks, some buttons, more buttons. These have like little beads inside of them. Pumpkins. Look at the pumpkins, guys. This is awesome. So cool. Some zippers, little hats. This is all like crafting gold. Crafting gold. Look at the little pumpkins. It's a bag of pumpkins. Are you joking me? Unbelievable. Oh, we got to sell these. Easter is coming up ASAP. ASAP. All right, what's this? This is, uh, okay, so it's not all jewelry. What is this, felt? I just sold a bag of felt the other night, and it sold for like $7. This is all like fabric, old fabric and felt, right? Is that what this is? Kind of smells like smoke a little bit. I'm going to have to disclose. Yeah, this is like old fabric. Yo, old fabric. People love old fabric. Especially crafters, DIYers, they love old fabric. So, looks like we got more of that. We got fabric here. We got more fabric here. We got another one. We got another one. We got another one. Wow. This is, okay, we're never going to get this back the way it was. All right, let's just pull some things back out here. Look at that. We got an egg there. This is all just bananas. I mean, this person really liked their crafting stuff. Enough to where they put it away in a safe location. But then abandoned it. So, I, you know, I guess it's cool, but maybe it doesn't become a priority when other things become a priority in life. So, which, you know, I get that. All right, anything else down here? We got some, some other thread. Looks like we got like some forestry stuff. Got some Christmas stuff in here, some flowers, some floral stuff. So this is, uh, this is another winner, guys. This one's gonna come back, back home with me. And we're gonna try and sell all this stuff. I love the pumpkins. Okay. Hopefully I can fit this stuff in the car. I don't have the truck, so I have this false sense of uh, confidence here. But I wanna get this box right here. This will be the last one we do tonight because I think we found quite a bit already. I think, unless this is a dud. I don't think it will be. I think I see something interesting. Okay, first of all, dove soap. So much dove soap. That will sell. So will this, even though it's a little dirty here. Oh, look at that. Crosses, USA crosses. Some more dove soap. And it's one of those. Extendable, cool. All right, Panasonic batteries. Those are good batteries. Now this is what I came for. Look at this. Look at these bags. That's a cool bag. Got the skulls all over it. Ooh, are these Coach? Look at that. Is that Coach? Is this really Coach? It says Coach on it. Is this a real Coach? That would be cool. All right, well, I can sell this, but I, I'm not going to say that it's real. And then this has a pretty cool pattern on it. I don't know if that's uh, Gucci or not, but probably not. Yeah, the quality of that, no way. But we like bags. We like bags a lot around here. Oh, nice. Look at this. Disney, baby. We got Minnie Mouse on this one. Let's see if we can open it, see if, the, uh, see if this is still good. Probably hasn't been opened in a little while, so we're going to go gingerly. Make sure we don't break anything. Seems right. Oh, look at that. A little card in here. It's like an authenticity thing. That would be cool. Look at that. $15 for this for Disney from Disney. So well, we're going to go ahead, put that aside. That's fun. This has schmutz on it. Schmutz. It's like sand. It feels full. It feels full of something. It feels like it's got something in here. What's it got in here? A million dollars. Oh, more bags. Lots more bags. Okay, what are you? I don't know what you are. Nice bag. I don't know how nice, but nice enough. This is a backpack. This is another little bag. Oh, look at that, some shells. I wonder if they took something to the, the beach here or something. I don't know. Where there's shells, there might be a beach trip. We got a purple bag here. We'll sell all the bags. The bags will sell. This one's a little rough, but hey, look at that. Got another bag inside of it. This is a, what was that? Liz. Liz Bourne? This is nice though. Seems to be really nice quality. Any money? You always gotta check, guys. You always gotta check. You never know. Well, look at that. It's a little money compartment here, like a little wallet. 
inside of a wallet. Maybe a little checkbook or something. That's cool. All right, we like that. We still don't know if this is any good, but you know what? We'll probably sell it. So anything else in here? Yep, there's one more. Sunglasses bag, let's go. With a tassel. Awesome. All right, this is all great stuff, guys. This is all great stuff. Unreal. All right. The thing with this bag is that it's a little bit messed up here. So I don't know if anybody's going to want it, but we'll offer it up for a dollar and see if anybody wants it. It's up to them, not me. I don't know what people want. I can just offer it up. And if they don't want it, then there we go. Roxic. Interesting bag. It's a very interesting bag. This blanket is interesting also. Ooh, that's a nice old blanket. Wow. Look at the hit on that. That's gorgeous. That's, that's definitely vintage. So put that here. Got a lot of saveable stuff tonight, guys. Tonight's been successful, that is for sure. We got lots of bags here. This is a media gear. Mm, I don't know. Some of these have a little funky smell to them. I don't know. What is this? Got an interesting uh, logo on it. Lots of bags, lots of, lots of bags. Purses, this one feels like leather. It says New York Studio on it. These are all, I think, pretty cheap bags, but maybe somebody will want one or two of them. Look at that. There's three bags here, not just one. But, whoa, and even more. This is a Betsy Johnson. This is a Sephora. There's a lot of bags they fit in this box. Unbelievable. Wow. So now I got to put these all back together. I don't know what kind of bag this is. Looks leather, but I don't know. I'm not going to do anything with it. I'm just going to offer it up for sale. If anybody wants it, they can have it. If not, we'll donate it. All right, nothing in here. I like the floral in there. Looks pretty cool. More bags. More bags, more bags, more bags, more bags. This has two compartments. It's kind of smell a little bit. Okay, this has some stuff in it. Any money? This is a, it says Brazil on it. What is this? Plastic baggie here. Oh, nothing. Okay, coupons, coupons, CT lottery. Come on, give me a $10 bill. Nothing. Anita Smith. This is crazy. There's so many bags in here. It's unbelievable. Unbelievable. It's kind of like those uh, those eggs. They're those uh, Fabergé eggs. Like the eggs with the people in them. You guys know what I'm talking about. The eggs, you know, the things with the people and the eggs. Okay, lots of bags. Six, seven, nine. 10, 11, at least 11 bags in here. So that's at least $10. And about $10 in about five minutes of my time. Boom, not bad. Do I wanna keep going? Do I want to keep going? I really wanna keep going. Take one of these bags here. Let's take this whole bag in here, this whole bag situation out, situation. See if there's anything we can do with these bags. Maybe we could put bags inside of bags. And that might be easier for us. Situation, that says Prada. It's not actually Prada, is it? I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. Interesting. That might spark enough conversation to get a sale or two. Maybe a do maybe one above a dollar or so. But we won't know until we know, you know? All right, I've taken my purse game and turned it into a bag game. Look at that. All right, I'm gonna get a cart over here. And let's just see how much we got going. All right, guys, so that's gonna conclude it for this video. A little bit of a shorter one, but we got a lot of great crafting stuff and all those pendants and stuff. Oh my gosh, we're gonna make some money on that. So I can't wait to update you guys on the budget, which because we're in the future, we're already like a couple weeks ahead. So here it is. We are getting closer and closer to that Dotson goal. So I'll keep you guys posted. Thanks all for the love and support. It means the world to me. I'll see you guys on the next one.